Hey, what's up guys? I'm here to give you a tour of Mission Santa Cruz. So, um, I really hope you like it because this took me a really long time to do. And let's get started. So over here is the bell tower and there's a cross up here. Yeah. Yay! And then there's a bush and yes, that is in the real mission. And there is the bell up there and then over next to it is the cemetery and the big crosses where the missionaries where they were buried and then the little tiny little gravestones were for the neophytes and the neophytes were the um, Native American tribes that came to the mission to learn about Christianity and or who were or also who were converted to Christianity so now here is the chapel or the church and it is um, where they would go to pray and these are the, the benches or the pews that the Native Americans would sit in and they would read from this Bible and up here is the balcony where the, the Native Americans would sit if they had no room to sit down here and there probably wouldn't be enough room because there's not a lot of benches. And then right here, there is the bell tower. I sh this is part of the bell tower, but inside of it. This is where they would, or the priests would come, they would ring the bell, and this would call the Native Americans to either wake up, breakfast, praying, working, lunch, or dinner. And um, at certain times of the day, they would ring it. So, ring. And they would ring, and then they would the Native Americans would come to the mission. And then here's the front of the or the front of the the back of the church where the priest would stay. He he would pray to the Native Americans like, "Oh, pray, holy God, na na na." And then here is the courtyard and there's a pathway and some oak trees scattered all around and then there's a fountain which I accidentally broke a piece off of. And then um, there is the workshops, and this is the priest quarters. So there's only two ways to get into the courtyard, and this was by the priest quarters or the back of the church, which I showed you. They got out. I went out by there. And in here, you could you could cook food or water, and there's water right now boiling. And then there was a bed, a chest, and a table for eating, and then some books to read. This is where the priests would stay, but most of the time it was only for it was tra where travelers would stay if they needed shelter because it rained a lot where they were. So I'm going to now show you the workshops. And in the workshops, you would have a lot of furnaces to smelt stuff or cook stuff, and you would have chests of iron and you would have anvils to shape the tools. And the neophytes would work in the, in the blacksmith shop or the workshop and they would make the tools and they would use the tools they made to work in the farms and the fields. And in here, it's the storage room. There's hay, some chests, and some supplies. And here they would keep, they would usually keep food, clothing and other things they would need for living at the mission. So now I'm going to show you the stables over here and here's my little dog and he would herd the animals if they would get out. So and here we have the horses and these horse are the mules and they would they would um, carry supplies and stuff from far away. And then in here we have cows pit and pigs and they just they are used for like milk, meat and stuff like that. And here they were sheeps and sometimes they would keep little um, chickens for eggs and things that they would need. So this is the stables and um, yeah. So as we come over here, we have the farm and on the farm they grew grain, some more grain, carrots, more carrots, beans, and more beans. And 
um, these were the the grain was for bread and things like that needed grain, like bread and um, other types of food. And the carrots, um, they would they would eat the carrots just plain. And then the beans were for food also. All these they used for food. And as I come over here, I come back to the front of my machine. And think and so this is again Mission Santa Cruz. It was the twelfth mission founded by Father Fermin Laswain. And the neophytes had a very hard life here because it was they were always getting punished and it was always there was a lot of earthquakes and floods that happened over here. And then also, um, they didn't get much freedom because they were forced to do things that they didn't want to do. And they weren't allowed to do anything. They weren't allowed to pray to their their beliefs. They had to do, they had to have Christian, they had to pray to the Christian. They had to be Christian and couldn't have their beliefs. So, thank you guys for watching my tour. And I hope you really liked it. Thank you.